Angelo has been the driving force behind Beauty and the Bistro, which is a community-based initiative to purchase a digital mammography machine with biopsy attachment for Joseph Grant Hospital. Our goal was to achieve $450,000 over three years with zero cost. So every penny went to the machine and we achieved that goal. It's in operation at the hospital now. He gives over and over of his time, his expertise, his leadership, goods, uh, to various community organizations and events to help them achieve their goals. He never says no. He never asks for anything in return. His leadership is evident in everything he does. He's just made Burlington a great place. My Britt works with the North Burlington Community Dinners because she likes to work together. It's a collaboration of churches and community organizations. And she sees the effect and the impact that it has in the community. She plans a dinner not knowing how many will come, what food she'll have, and who will be coming to help. And she's done that twice a month now for three years. She has a real heart for Burlington and for people. So she sees the effect of the dinners on those who come. Uh, many of them are, have been under-resourced, but others are just lonely and discouraged, and she sees them developing friendships and connections over the good food, and they get accepted and encouraged, and I just think they're influenced to a better life. Ron joined our board of directors uh, July 2014, and on August the 4th, Burlington received 191 millimeters of rain in less than four hours, which was really categorized as our 100, uh, 100 year storm. And on August the 10th, um, shortly after Ron joined our board, I called Ron to ask him to chair, um, in a volunteer manner, the Disaster Relief Committee efforts. Not only from a fundraising perspective, but supporting the disaster relief um, application to the province for the two-to-one matching, and then to help us on all the recovery efforts. Typical to Ron, he came on with guns a-blazing, fully enthusiastic, and made everybody feel great about helping and was just the world's greatest leader in a time of challenge, which is uh, worthy of this award for sure. Ron dedicated over 700 hours of volunteer time to support the flood relief efforts. And as, as Jeff said, his leadership and his, I think his mobilization, um, he himself, himself really caused a movement uh, to happen uh, in, the, in the city and to uh, support flood victims in, in, in great need at a, at a time that um, was quite shocking for the entire community. So, you know, there are, there are often silver linings in, in disasters and devastation, and Ron uh, is and was definitely a silver lining.